Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, Miyogi. Yep, it's been a while since I did my last playthrough, and welcome to our first ever Wangan Midnight Let's Play for a PlayStation 3. Yep, that's right. I've been following the slap chain and other guys, and I tried to, you know, well, you can look at the platinums below that I already completed the game. But, shame because of this, I won't be able to show you which cards you're gonna get according to each arc. But regardless, we're still gonna play it anyway. We're gonna start off with Akio Sakura story. Anyway, let me give you a quick back of when I fix up my card system. Um, Wagon Midnight PlayStation 3 was one of the last games created by Genki next to Wagon Midnight Portable. Right after that, Genki closed down. RIP. And what happened was, um, unlike the PlayStation 2 version that we have already covered, this one is even more in-depth. And what I mean by more in-depth? More playthrough on the story mode. That's even longer. It's even freaking longer. This is gonna be the most hectic let's play I've ever done in my life. But before we get started, I just want to take out- Yes, the autosave. Cause I wanna keep my cards. I wanna keep my cards whenever I open this again for like solo player or something like that. I'll explain later what the cards do. So, looks like once we're done with that, we're ready and let's just remove my cards first. Alright, there's Yamamoto, take out Katami, Tomonaga, Takagi, uh, Kuroki, yep, Oda. Younger Oda. Alright, since we're done, let's begin with Series 1, S30Z. Alright, to give you an overview, that opening was something from Akio's flashback and the news that came out was of Akio Asakura, the old Akio, age 16, dying in a car accident two years ago, right after Akio saw the car itself. So, since we don't have any cards and we're starting off 287 for Z31, let's see how far I'm gonna go with this. Anyway, so... Like I said, the story is even more in-depth, they have better voice acting, and my god, that music! It just went through my heart. Oh my god, hold on. What? That car? That car? Blackbird? You're going to die, right? What? For the record, Shiba cannot go up that way and back at the same instance. Really? Can't believe it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, right, forgot. I'm sorry. I kinda forgot that I was on. Why well, midnight? I'm not using Gran Turismo. I accidentally used the E brake on that part. Anyway, regardless, now we're gonna go back in action. Okay, so, the only parts I'm gonna depend on upgrading would simply be the customizing parts, the exhaust. That's it! Stage 1 is very easy, just keep up with Blackboard in under 200 meters and you're okay. Watch the cinematic. Akio, you wish! As you can see on the movement of the cinematics, they strictly follow the anime and manga. That's what I like about this game. Hey, 
奴はもう何年も負け知らずの湾岸の帝王だぜあもう行こうぜいつまでこんなところにいるんだよあどうしたあの車、Z、が一番初期型の S30 型ってやつだな。クロ、これの車検証あるかえー、っとあ、あった、これだ。お,おい、アキオ、前のほら、お前と同姓同名だぜ。へえ、ほんとだ、気持ち悪い。こりゃ、お前に買ってくれって言ってんだよ。クロ、いくらだ、あの Z。いやそれがさこの車持ってきたやつが絶対スクラップにしてくれっていわゆるヤバい車かいいですよ別に気にしないですよ売ってくださいあの Z さあ、so、if you weren't listening or reading through the subtitles it pretty much、um, shows the opening sequence where Akiyu met the Z まさか本当に買っちまうとはなこの Z をなんつうかさ思い出しちゃってさこれ見ると思い出す ?3 年前たった一度パッと目の前を走っていた S30 の Z 隣にショートカットの女の子乗せててさすげえ渋いのどっちが女か Z かまあどっちも開けよう。今夜あたり行くか。湾岸に。And what's the freaky part about this is that、um, the old Akio's、um, name is similar to this Akio. That's what's freaky. You know, I haven't, other than the Kevin Cruz stuff here in the Southeast Asian region, especially in the America slash、uh, Philippine region. There's like a one in a million chance for one to have the same name as another person, especially that of Japan. I could be wrong, but that's what's freaky. Down to the kanji, Akio Asakura, the name. Really scary to find that one out. Alright, so, race 2 of、um, series 1 is simple. Beat Kochan! That's it! You don't need to do anything! And now from 280, we're now going double the value up to 600. Actually, 615 because of the exhaust. A little about the exhaust system.、Um, there are only two characters featured. One is Matsu from the Hiromoto arc. We will see him later on. And one is、um, Shige from the Osaka arc. And as you can see, there's、um, uh, extra snippets of cinematics right in between the races. What I'm simply doing right now is、uh, not going on full throttle, just like in reality. And we get that as a result.、Eh, not bad. I'll tell you about the ranking system later. Kochan, I'm going to tell you about the Zetto. アサクラっていうあの元オーナー2年前まで湾岸で有名だったらしい2年前じゃあもう引退したのかいや死んだんだ死んだ He died ブラックバードって知っているだろう事故った時一緒に走っていたのはそいつらしいんだ比較的軽傷だった Z は修復されオーナーが変わるたび事故を重ねていったんだみんなそいつのことを悪魔の Z と呼んでいるらしい悪魔の Z And on that note they finally discovered the name of the scary S30Z The Devil Z Or in Japanese 悪魔の Z 今夜も行くのか湾岸にうん、ちょっとね最高だよこうちゃんいくら走っても走り足りないんだこいつとなら
惚れ込むのもいいけどよそれなりに過去がありそうな車だし冷静にな大丈夫だってこうちゃん本当にすごくいいマシンなんだこいつどんなやつが来ても絶対負けっこないよ無茶すんなよ秋代That piano, that guitar, that guitar. Nothing to say but that guitar. <laughs> All right, so this time we're going to the wagon alone, and Kochin just tells us to be careful, don't overdo ourselves. I wonder why. Black Bar. Not sure. 死んだあいつの Z だ。OK。いいぜ。Now it's getting serious. Finally, we get some serious battles. Now all you need to do is block his left lane, because that's where it's gonna come out. Do not believe the cinematics. They lied to me. Dang it! It's gonna block on the left. They came on the right. How is that possible? Unless I was watching the cinematics of Mirror. エリコこの Z をドライブしてるのはお前の兄貴かおまえが Anyway, so she was not actually only in the first stretch そうか、そ死んだもう2年も前だ the Only on the first stretch is where she was serious and he's pretty much cruising on the side もういいやめて And let me introduce you to Eriko She's um uh when Drago over the Z no not Akio. Actually both. Why? Cause she assumed that though that's the same Z that took her brother's life. <laughs> Honestly, since we're just beginning, it's not that it's really hard to make this comical. But once we get to the further parts. When we get to the um, further parts, you will see me go, OH COME ON! For various reasons. Ah, the infamous part where the protagonist is not OP. This makes this even better than initially, honestly. I'm not saying to any haters, but that's how it is. It's even better than initially. That's the only thing I'm gonna say right now. Because the protagonist cannot be OP for- OH MY GOD! Why now? Holy good lord, that was oh my god, I can't believe it. That was the first. Yo,はドライブですか？湾岸の黒い会長さん。君はあの Z の朝倉です。朝倉明夫。本当なんですよ同姓同名ってわけあの Z はどうしたんだそのうちひょっこり現れますよ湾岸に Honestly, on the last panel earlier, that was scary. I was shocked. なんでここがガソリンスタンドで聞いたの髪伸びたんだな最初は分かんなかったよ3年前あの Z の隣に乗ってたんだよなお前その Z に乗ってて兄貴は死んだの朝倉明夫教えて
どうして他の車じゃダメなのどうしてこの Z じゃなきゃダメなのわかんねえよそんなことは同じ名前でも俺はお前の兄貴じゃない過去はどうあれ今は俺の Z だたとえあくまでも俺はこいつがいいただそれだけだ帰ってブラックバードに伝えろ来週水曜午前3時湾岸市川パーキングエリアで待つ湾岸の黒い会長と言われたお前を悪魔の Z が叩き落としてやるってな Pretty much Akio now has achieved きた。ブラックバードだ、秋夫。ワンガンから羽田へ出て横羽経由ベイブリッジゴールでどうだ。オッケー。乗れよ、俺のゼットに。もしかしたらわかるかもな。この前なぜって聞いた意味か。いいよ
かいいねこの絶対にかどうかしっかりと見ろそしてそしてマネック Trust me, when I say I'm gonna use this on Fujin, I might and I will. Screw it, I will! <laughs> Just look at that Z. <laughs> Didn't I? Wasn't I right when I said it's gonna look good on camera when I wasn't going on full throttle? Now I'm reluctant to do a relentless playthrough of this. You know what? Screw the relentless playthrough. Let's just keep it like this. That way we can keep the graces even more dramatic. By the way, there's a reason why pausing every time they speak is pretty much giving due, dus due justice to the Seiyus. Something from the original Seiyus from the original Wang and Minin anime. And how they delivered it was so good. That's the kind of voice acting quality I wanted to have and get. Not just for my series, don't get me wrong, but almost anything I do that needs voices. Wait, hey, Shima, I thought you were in the same lane. What? What? You're swerving right? How did you end up on the left? Seriously? Wow, it's Oh, also, what's the great thing about this? On the replays, they took out the goal bars. It's vital for a machinima or. Or parody races, etc. How you want to call it? Do you do the replay? Yatsuka Shindama, Omae no Sei Janai. So that's all. Zetto. Actually, Akio Seiyu forgot to say one vital、um, line there, which is it's the same situation, but I'm not gonna fall for it this time or again. That's one of the vital lines that Akio made in that race. Wakata Kai. Trust me, I've been watching this game a lot. Z じゃなく、俺のドライブミスだったよな。もう一度、ブラックバードに伝えてくれよ。きっとまた湾岸に現れるから、俺と Z。その時は、あっさりとちぎってやるってね。そうさこれからが始まりさ俺と Z の湾岸ストーリーがな I bet most of you guys only understood that last part <laughs> anyway so yeah series one this is where everything is gonna begin Akio's Wangan story the revived Devil Z series one told it all and we get a silver Alright, on the rankings! That's your ticket on getting the better cards, and the card system is what helps modify your card in the series. That's what, all that I'm gonna say right now. And we're gonna go into further detail on what each card does pretty soon on the next part. So, I know you guys demanded this so much. Sorry if this first episode wasn't that comical. Don't worry, I might. If I ever do the、um, survival mode, that is gonna be where it's even more comical. Trust me. Survival mode is more stressful than this. I'm already saying it right now, it's even more stressful. And why we're doing survival mode for that one soon? Because. That's where you get to unlock the other characters, like the. Because this one is just until Kuroki's arc, to be a surprise. Spoiler! For you to unlock AG, i、um, Kijima. Oh, for the PSG bonus and the PSP, Makoto Morishita and, a and Garage Ace. You need to go through survival mode. Story mode does not release them. And by the way, we're gonna get also the other special trims of the other characters right in this arc. And this is what I remembered after not playing this. You guys will be surprised by Masaki's voice, voice actor. So suave. 
Anyway, so we're gonna cut it right here, and we'll see you guys next time as we take on series two. I forgot what series two kanjis is, but trust me, all of these stages, except for the last one with the screaming guy's face, all of these stages are so badass. And they have their own exclusive races. You'll see why soon. Anyways, this is Miyogi saying see you guys next time.